Welcome everyone to another Stamp Out Your Art with Virginia WG101 Independent Stampin' Up! Demonstrator. Uh, I'm going to show you some new watercolour pencils that will be available to purchase from the 1st of August. I received my pre-order this week and there's 10 new colours and they are gorgeous. Uh, I've stamped my butterf uh, dragonfly which is from this stamp set Dragonfly Dreams and I'm going to colour in the wings I've stamped with Stazon which is an alcohol based ink so when you're using watercolours you want the opposite of your ink so this is a permanent um, solvent based ink and I'm going to choose this gorgeous new Coastal Cabana and the beautiful gorgeous grape and to blend it in I have a blender pen now some of you have seen me color before and you know that um, because I watercolor when I lay down my color it's a little bit rough and ready but the end result is usually quite stunning so I'm going to start with the coastal cabana and I'm just going to apply it to the outer edges of my wings and bring it in just a little bit you don't need a lot because these pence, watercolour pencils are so rich and creamy and they perfectly go with all the ink pads and cardstock that Stampin' Up! have available for you to purchase. So that's all I'm going to use. Oh, I have a little bit more there. At the Coastal Cabana. Then I'm going to lightly use the Gorgeous Grape because when you see this blended it is so rich and vibrant just the most stunning purple and we'll just fill in these little bits here I'm leaving a little bit of a gap because that's where I'm going to blend it, the two in together and um, you know if you've seen out in the wild a dragonfly their wings are iridescent and if you have a look at my nails I've kind of got gossamer wing nail lacquer on. I don't know if it's coming up very well. But I thought, oh, that's so pretty. And that will go with my dragonfly wings. So, pardon my voice. I've woken up with a sore throat today. So, hopefully it'll go away soon. So, I'm just um, using my blender pen to blend in the colour. And then I'm going to bring it up and blend it in with the purple. And it's just so simple. These blender pens are a perfect accompaniment to your craft supplies. They work with any brand of, of watercolour pencils. So if you haven't got these ones yet, do get them because they're worth every cent. Um, there are two sets you will be able to get as of the 1st of August. I'll just turn that around so I can do this side. Um, the first set that came out last year is a permanent um, item in the annual catalogue. And this second set, um, there's talk of it continuing on after the 1st of August. August. Don't quote me on that. But um, the, the watercolour pencils have become so popular that I think Stampin' Up! are on the right track. And... I live in hope that one day that every single Stampin' Up! colour will be available in a watercolour pencil. So there you go, there the wings. Now to give it a little bit of a shimmer, like my fingernails, I'm going to grab my Wink of Stella and I'm going to put some gossamer on those wings. So I'll just give that a bit of a shake, take the lid off and give it a squeeze. And this is just the prettiest, prettiest. And you will see uh, how it's created the gossamer on the wings. And I'll pick it up and tilt it for you when I've done one side. And um, I don't know about you, but I, I just love butterflies and, and dragonflies. I love it when I go out in my garden and sit with my cats in the cat enclosure and I see them flittering about 
in my garden it's just so pretty so I hope you can see that now I've tilted a few this way and that another thing you could probably do is there's some solid stamps in this stamp set these ones what you could possibly do is stamp over the top of this once you've colored it in don't use the wink of Stella stamp with that using Versamark and then sprinkle it with embossing powder and make them glossy so that's another idea so this is one of my favorite stamps uh, stamp set and I'll pop back later with a finished project to show you just how lovely it is bye for now